ladies and gentlemen, let's bring us the stage. You next to me, very funny guy. Put your hands together, Mr. Michael Burger, everybody. <laughs> So I'm home, we you know we're getting laid at home a lot, I'm watching TV. You guys watch the Food Network at all? Yeah. Okay, well so those of you that did, anything over here, but pay attention over here, because you all can watch the Food Network. This guy, Guy, Guy Fieri, Fieri, something like that, he's got, can you check this kitchen out. He's got an industrial sized refrigerator, he's got a pool table, this is the kitchen, he's got hubcaps on the wall, I don't have a hubcap on my car, right? And he's, he's making his freaking seeds, souffles, all this stuff. You know what, I can't relate to that. Who can relate to that? I need a cooking show for the common man. And my cooking show would be like, what can my cooking show? I hope you enjoyed our entry last week. We toast. Today we're gonna make, let's see what we have here. Today we're gonna make eggs. So we need for eggs. We need a pan, some butter. You can't have eggs without eggs. One egg, two egg, then sizzle. There's your eggs. Tune in next week, we're gonna make cereal. <laughs> so, you know, I'm home and I'm working on TV, I'm watching the computer, I'm addicted to porn. I mean, I could be addicted to something cool like heroin or cocaine. I have friends who are like, oh shit, who is this guy? So, right? So, I'm digging the computer images, so I'm getting a heart on there every time I'm fondling the mouse. You know, I gotta call my sponsor every time I check my email. It's not, it's not pretty. It's just not pretty. And, you know, dating is tough too. You know, I blame, I blame you, man. I do. Not you, man, but you, woman over here. I blame you. You know why? Because, and guys, you, you, you know this, women, you like the bad boys, right? Let's get honest. You like the bad boy. Oh, you guys, damn, that's right. Where the bad boys at? Oh shit, I guess I'm the only one. Look at that. So now I can be bad. Now this shirt, it's wrinkled. I don't give a fuck. Why? Because I'm bad. That's right. I'm a bad man. These clothes, they don't match. You think I can? I don't give a shit. Why? Because I'm bad. Ladies, are you nervous or horny? Which one? Which one again? Which one again? I'm a bad man. I'm too. Call, leave a message after the beat. Fucked out before the beat. That's right. Bad boys, bad boys. What you gonna do when I come for you? I come for you? No? After dinner? No. I'm just trying to check out, but it's, it's great. So, but, <clears throat> dating is really, it's really tough. But, uh, you know, it's funny. We got some. What we say. I'm gonna let you know a little secret what we say about you, ladies. You know, we like you. We say some pretty crazy things. For example, see what we see. See the brunette over here? I would tear that shit up! But now I'm gonna near shit, cut shit, touch shit. I don't, I don't know what the shit is that about, but that's what we say. Oh my god, it's craziness. But my favorite, my favorite, I don't shoot the messenger. This is what we say. You guys, you know we say this shit too. We'll see a beautiful woman say, hey, see that brunette over there? Yeah, see. That one, no, no, more of a, yeah, yeah, real hot one, absolutely. Yeah, what are you doing, bro? I would fuck the hell out of her. Now, I know there's some moves and odds, but we say this, guys, you know this. Now, I don't know exactly how that works. I'm you know, fucking the hell out of someone. But if it's true, I'd love to be like a priest on the exorcist or something. You know? I've got some religious folks that are being very offended by this. It's just a show. I don't really do this. Just follow along. So, look, we're the exorcist. We have a woman on the bed here, right, making love. Maybe some John Mayer. Your body's a wonder. Your body's a wonder. I'll hold your hand. Making love, making love. It's all good. It's all good. All of a sudden, a huge fireball shoots out of the pistons, flying on the ceiling. I'm hearing like cartoon voices. You man, you're fired. And you little dog too. You're fired. As soon as it appears, it's gone. That we was fucked up, right? Then I look down and I. Lady here, and all of a sudden, she's got like angel wings right on her back and a halo on her head, you know. And I'm looking down at her and I'm saying, Whew, sweetie, I mean, uh, I don't know what's happened, but uh, I think I just fucked the hell out of you. <laughs> you know, I was there before, 